Hello everybody. Today I have an accessory video for you. It's a pair of sunglasses that I ordered from Frame and Optic from Fountain Valley, California. And I'm just keeping my thumb over the address. So, my home address. So basically, I've already opened them, but it's an unboxing video. So I'll just take you through the product, why I ordered it, and sort of what they look like and my opinion on it. So Again, I just have my thumb over my home address. So I'll just open it like this. So this is the product right here. And the bag that it comes in. And just the shipping receipt. So I'll just keep that in there. Move the box over to the side. So here's the overall product. A nice little silk bag to keep the sunglasses in. Keep them from getting scratched or damaged. Or dust on them. And it's just a little drawstring bag like many sunglasses have. Or a bag you can get free with a purchase of sunglasses. And here's the product. Now that I, I'm really looking at these now, I kind of don't know why I got these. I mean, they look like LeVar Burton's visor from Star Trek uh, Next Generation. The real concern I have of these is, like normal sunglasses or prescription glasses, here's the part that goes over your ear, right? And the front, of course, doesn't have a nose piece. Anywhere here, it's, it's smooth. Another part for where the ear. So then when you wear them, they go on like this. But then, isn't this part for the bridge of your nose? Because there's no support here for your nose. So then if you flip them over, where this would be incorrect, and they look like this, isn't that the nose piece? So something really isn't right here. I'm not going to show how they look on me personally, but... Something about these doesn't seem like they're designed properly, so they are cool to wear. They look futuristic. They look like something out of Back to the Future as well. Number two from when they go to 2015, and Doc Brown's wearing them. He has an all-silver pair. These are like black, like a silver strip. So they're, they look like Robocop for like the Terminator. The glasses they had in those movies. So it, it could be used as like a, a neat little movie prop or just, I don't know who would really wear these like full time, just outside when they're walking their dog or jogging or overall wanting to be seen in public with these if it wasn't for like a costume or Halloween, but they aren't that bad. Just something about them seems to be designed poorly, so. Thank you for listening to my short little review and my opinions of this product and please subscribe and stay tuned for more videos as it will get more opinionated and more amateur as it goes. And remember to... Okay.